Kill Cat back with another video, man. About to go hit the gym. About to get my cardio on, man, because I've been eating junk. So I got to get in there and do about at least 40 minutes of cardio. Just sprints and walks. That's it. Sprint, walk, sprint, walk, sprint, walk. You know? I didn't celebrate Thanksgiving, man, because my sister didn't cook. So I said, fuck it. I don't want to celebrate that shit, man. Just stacking my bread, focusing on becoming wealthy. You know what I mean? I always wanted to be wealthy since I was like a little kid. It's just the fact that I got I got caught up with the wrong bitch, man. I got caught up with the wrong bra and I let her, man. You know? That really got me off track. That's why I'm trying to stay away from, like, chicks who want relationships. You know what I'm saying? I know some of you guys are like, nah, just get bad buddy, man. Just get a bad buddy. That shit turns into a relationship, man. I know myself. You know, I don't want to get off track. You know, yeah. If a bra came on strongly, you know what I mean? If she came on really strong, then yeah, I'll fuck her. You know what I'm saying? But other than that, it's like, dude, you got to understand. Becoming wealthy is more, more important than fucking getting pussy, man. Will I take it if they fucking offer it to me? Hell yeah, I'm a man. But going out on dates and coffee dates and shit like that, man, that's cool. You know what I mean? I, I mean, there's a lot of chicks out there that give they're giving me signals and shit. You know, maybe when I get back on the on the juice, you know, then I might change my mind. Right now, I really don't feel like putting the energy into like going to go buy new fits new clothes to impress you know what I'm saying dating costs money whether you like it or not man it could be some for some tea or coffee and shit like that what am I missing just sex I mean come on some of you guys like you just missed out on opportunities man you, you missed out on opportunities you doing this you doing that and I'm like chill guys I mean damn you know If the bra giving me, you know, choosing signals, you know, and she has a boyfriend, eventually I'm going to try to break that barrier. Like the girl at the gym, right? I'm going to chop her down. I got to hurry up and ask her out soon. But I just want to want it to be on the down low. I'm going to see what she says. You know, once I ask her out, I want I want to see her reaction. You know. Is, is she going to cheat on her boyfriend with me? That's the question. You know. I'll do it. Shit. I don't care about her boyfriend. That motherfucker ain't no kid to me. I don't know that dude. You know. All I know, I'm taking the night off. And I might take tomorrow night off too. My fucking uh, head hurts and I've been working like a dog lately. You know? The girl at the gym. Giving me strong choosing signals. Strong vibes. And I'm like, okay, I gotta make a move on this before it's too late. Before she changes her mind. Because she's a little hottie, man. She's a little sweet tea. <laughs> like, like like Drake said. You know what I'm saying? She's sm she short. She's hella cute. You know what I'm saying? I know I'm an old guy. And I'm supposed to be trying to fuck everything that walks before I get too old. But you know, you gotta realize, man. Once I become successful, I'll be fucking bitches hotter than her. You know what I mean? I'll be fucking hotter bitches than that. That's what I got my mind on right now, man. It's like, I don't want to be poor for the rest of my life. I'm putting in the discipline and hard work. I got cash stacked up, man. You know what I mean? 
I ain't got no help. So you guys should be donating to the channel, man. Donate to the fucking channel. My PayPal, I'm going to try to put it into the link and shit, man. If you guys want me to be on that juice faster, donate to the channel. You guys are act, asking about trend and stuff. I would get my hands on it faster if you guys were donating. But I, I got to save my money and stuff. You know what I'm saying? You don't have to donate a lot. Because I know you guys are trying to save your money too. Just donate a few dollars. Do donate five bucks. Do donate ten dollars. You know what I'm saying? I'm encourage you. Uh, I'm encourage you guys to save your money. You know, and do better. I'm putting that positive message out there. Support the cause. You know. Since you're not going to the bar. Spending your money there, just donate, you know, five bucks to the to the uh, Kelcat channel, you know. It ain't like it ain't like I'm getting rich off the donations, man. It's just helping out. It's helping a lot, you know. Only if you can, though. If you're struggling, you don't have to donate to the channel. Only if you, you know, got some extra money or something like that. That you ain't gonna miss. Donate to the channel. Everybody, all the other YouTubers get donations and stuff. See Boogie, he get donations all day long. You know? And plus, when I get donations, man, that helps me a lot. That helps me continue this channel. You know what I'm saying? When I don't get donations, I, I still do it because it's my passion. YouTube is my passion, but, you know. But it encouraged, encouraged me to keep going. Just like all these other YouTubers. They get donations. And it keeps them coming out with videos. You know what I'm saying? It keeps them motivated to do videos and stuff. And I've been doing this stuff for free for years. So, you know, I'm not doing this, doing this for the money. There is no money. You know what I'm saying? I've been doing this shit for years. I do it because it's a passion. You know? But anyway. Yeah, the females, man. You know, I'm trying. I'm trying to get some pussy, man. You know what I'm saying? It ain't like I'm not trying, but... You got to realize, man, I've been in cell for a while. When a chick of a high caliber gives me some play, I get nervous. I still going to ask him out. Hell yeah. But, you know... I, I'm kind of nervous, you know, because they're very good looking. And I forget I don't drop weight and I, I look good myself now, so. And a lot of these chicks, they like older dudes, man. As long as you look good and you got your body in check, they like older men. It's, if you're fat and out of shape, man, and, you know. You ain't gonna get too many younger women, man. As an older guy, anyway. You know? I know a lot of you guys are coming around the channel recommending me to do this, to do that. You know, just go out on a few coffee dates or whatever. You know? How am I going to do that when I can't find any single women up out here? I can't find any single women, dude. All these women are taken, especially the sevens. When I came out of the gym yesterday, or day before yesterday, the chick at the front desk, she was, she was surrounded by the men that worked there. And all of them were cracking jokes, trying to get her to laugh. You could tell they were just showing out for her. 
You know what I'm saying? That the competition for these chicks, these these sevens out here, ain't no joke. Okay. These motherfuckers out here, you know. And plus, man, if I start going out on dates, you know what I'm saying, I know I'm not not going to stop. You know what I'm saying? Like, you guys realize that I'm a real passionate human being and I'm going to want a relationship out of these fucking young females. You know what I'm saying? I know myself. That's why I... I'm taking a break away from dating so I can stack this bread. If I can find a bra that'll help me, that's fine. You know what I mean? But also, it's going to take money to make the relationship work. You know what I'm saying? Ain't no such thing as free this, free that. I stack more money, you know what I'm saying, while I'm by myself. Because when I'm, when I'm going after my dreams... It's a selfish deal. It's it's about you, not the other person. Would I look up and find a chick that, that's down? Maybe. You know what I mean? Do I want to have sex? Yeah, I do, man. I want to fuck, but that's not on my mind, man. My mind is taking care of my nephew my family and making sure they got good lives you know what I'm saying and making sure I have a good life you know that's all I care about right now man I, I, I'm just telling you guys my encounters with women man I'm telling you guys about my encounters you know and about to choose the signals that I receive Gotta stay hydrated. I'm about to hit this gym. You know, my time is short. I don't have a lot of time. You know what I mean? Before I, I turn 50 years old, I got 10 years left. And within that 10 years, I have to be I have to be really cautious about how I spend my time. You know what I'm saying? I gotta be really cautious. Yo, you know what I'm saying? And these chicks are cute too, man. The ones that's giving me play. They're not ugly bras, man. They're cute. Cute. I wish I could show you guys what these bras look like. If I could sneak a a peek of these bras, maybe, I mean, a picture or something on. You know, maybe record when they're not looking. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna try to do that. I'm gonna try to record some some uh, footage of of the broads that giving me choosing signals, just uh, you know, on the slide. You know, I'm gonna pretend like I'm playing with my phone and just press the record button on my phone, just only for like you know three or four seconds and then cut it off. You know. Like I said before, man, dating and stuff, that shit costs money. We're talking about, I got to go out and buy new clothes. I've been trying to avoid, avoid buying new clothes. I've been wearing the same clothes over and over again because I'm trying to save. You know what I'm saying? Every single last cent, every single last dollar I got. Yeah, I can go buy me some new like gym wear and stuff like that. 
but you know that's gonna cost money now if this channel was generating money then it'll give me a little bit more freedom to go buy clothes and stuff but this channel is not bringing in any money man and I just got fired from my one job my two jobs you know Lyft and Uber you know and I'm glad I'm not working for them no more DoorDash is way better and I, I make more money with DoorDash because of the gas dude all I gotta do is put like $25 in gas in my car and I can work the whole entire night and pull in 200 bucks take home so it'd be like 225 whatever you know and I take home 200 bucks all together I forget the taxes so I take a little bit out a little bit less than 200 bucks Maybe like 170, 175 or something like that. But um Yeah man, my mind focused on the future, dude. And I've been fucking off time in my past and I just don't want to fuck off any more time. That Gatorade is good, man. Nice and cold. So I've been trying to um, make sure that I save as much money as I possibly can. You know what I mean? Because you, you forget that we're black, man, and we don't get that same privilege like that. I don't, I'm a black man. I don't get that same privilege to waste time. I come to realize this. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? I can't like eat like a sloppy pig and still get a girlfriend. You know what I'm saying? I'm not privileged like that. You know? Boy, but these girls are cute, boy. They're young, too. They're like 22, 23. I think the girl behind the desk, she like 25, 26, something like that, man. These bras are cute. And got nice bodies, too, man. Nice bodies. You guys don't understand, man. It takes a total focus to get everything that you need. So the thing is, when I was doing music back in the day, I stayed away from women when I was uh, stacking bread and, and buying music equipment. Dude, I didn't have no sex. I didn't have no. I didn't have nothing. All I wanted was the uh, my music equipment. Dude, I was going to work. I had two jobs. I didn't have time like that to to date. And I got all I got all my money saved up. I saved up about what like three or four grand or something like that. Went out and bought a bunch of equipment. And then um started doing music in my little apartment. You know? I was recording songs in my little apartment and you know my friends my friends would fucking come over. You know. You know. When we were, we were rapping shit and sing. You know what I mean? I wasn't really active with females. I just wanted to write songs and um and produce and shit, man. But the moment women start getting into the mix, that's when I start to get distracted. And that's how the music dream just went out the window. And I, I could still get back on it if I wanted to. 
but I, I want to do acting. You know what I mean? I want to act. You know? You can't pursue both. You know what I mean? You can't pursue music and acting at the same time. You got to do one or the other. Because they both cost money to pursue. You know what I mean? And I want to be a free black man. I want to be able to move, you know, maybe to Japan one day. Fuck all the Asian bitches that I could fucking fuck. You know what I'm saying? Because out here, I feel like I'm a prisoner in the U.S. You know what I mean? And plus, in my area where I live, there's a lack of chicks up out here, man. A lack of single women, okay? All of these women out here got boyfriends. All of them. I can't find any single women, you know? Because out here, the ratio is 40 to 1. 40 dudes to one chick. No, every time a chick is single, she gonna be back in a relationship in a matter of time. So, if there's a single girl that pops up, it won't it won't be long before a dude comes along and snatches her up. So, dudes are beating you to the punch. All these women got like orbiters just hanging around. So it's hard to get a girlfriend. It's even harder to get like a bed a bed buddy chick. You know what I'm saying? Because these women already got them already. So it's like it's not the fact. It's not that I'm an ugly dude. It's the fact. It's the area that I'm in. I have to move out of the area. I might have to move back down to L.A. You know what I'm saying? Where there's plenty of women. L.A. got plenty of women. There's no shortage of women in L.A. The city's overpopulated. You know what I'm saying? So, it, it, you know what I'm saying? You can't have a shortage of women out there. You know, there was plenty of single women out there. Especially the ones that are like six, five, sixes, and sevens. Because those chicks don't even get looked at down there. The eight, nines, and tens outshine those those uh, fives, sixes, and sevens. So the rich guys and the other guys, they're going after the eight, nines, and tens. You know what I'm saying? Like I said before, when I was down in L.A., I fucked this virgin bitch. She was a virgin. Nah, she, I'm not going to lie. She was a six. You know what I'm saying? You know? I didn't know she was a virgin. Until after I fucked her, she told me, you know. So, women are giving me choosing signals, even though they are in relationships and shit, man. You know what I mean? And I might get to a point where like I, I'm gonna have to like I'm gonna have to fuck somebody's bitch man you know what I'm saying on the down low on the down down well look I got something I got some needs fuck that you know what I mean that's what I thought in my head the other day I was like man I'm gonna fuck somebody's bitch fuck it I don't care at this point I don't care if it's somebody's wife you know what I mean I got needs I need to get a blowjob you know what I'm saying? And I, I know if I get, once I get back on that trend, I'm going to be, man, <laughs> I'm definitely going to need some fucking uh, attention then. I'm going to be walking around like a horn dog. You know what I'm saying? So anyway, I got to get into the gym. You guys have a good night. You know, I didn't celebrate Thanksgiving because my cook, my sister didn't cook, so 
I said, fuck it. I got my money in my pocket. I'm, I'm focusing on my dreams, man. You know. And donate to the channel, man. You guys ain't donate nothing. You guys are just watching. Donate something. Whatever you can afford. Whatever you have. Have a good night. Subscribe to the channel. Leave a like and a comment. Click the notification button so you would never, ever miss another video from me. And I'm out.